Smart Pakistan Facility Solutions is introducing Human Health and Safety Awareness Series of Videos. This video is about electrical analysis of human body and its impact. In case of electric shock, cause of death is current passes through the body. Despite low level voltage touched, this shock can cause severe disability or even death. Let's see how this happens and how to save ourselves. This is the electrical analysis of human body. Here is Ohm's law and abbreviations used in this analysis. These calculations are based on 220 volts. Ear to ear, 100 ohms can pass 2.2 amps. Head to foot, 500 ohms can pass 440 milliamps. Dry skin, 2.2 milliamps. Wet skin causes the 220 milliamps. Now look the impact of current when passed through the human body. Start to feel level. Mild shock is felt. Ground fault circuit interrupter trip level. Can't let go value. Contraction of muscles. Suffocation is felt. Trouble in heart breathing or stops. Body gets severe burns. At this point, 200 watts lamp will glow. This study shows impedances of the various parts of the human body, resulting in an equivalent circuit for the electrical path through the body. Currents of about 10 milliampers can cause a very painful shock. The longer the current continues to pass through you, the worse it gets. Even a low magnitude of 36 volts can also cause serious consequences. If human body touched with wet skin and the body is touching the ground, can produce 36 milliamps. This 36 milliampers is harmful for human body, because 22 milliamps passing through human body, more than 99% of adults will not be able to bear it. These are general safety precautions. Never touch electric installations with barefoot or feet and wet hands. Never operate home and kitchen appliances, industrial and commercial equipment, with barefoot or damaged shoes. Never use any hand or power tool or any other electric equipment with damaged insulation. Children specific safety precautions are Never let to use or allow children to play or handle any type of electrical fittings. Do not use this type of fittings accessible to children. Use 3 pin child resistant shutter system power sockets. Never keep forks and alike things near power sockets. Some more useful facts of human safety. According to the IEEE standard, 80, low voltages, do not mean, low hazard. The severity of the shock depends on three factors. The path of the current through the body. The amount of current flowing through the body. The length of time the body is in the electric circuit. According to the IEEE standard, 80, the maximum safe duration of a shock can be determined by the formula given where 0.116 constant relevant to human body weight, where T is the time in seconds, E, the voltage and R, the resistance of the person, assumed to be 1000 ohms. For a 240 volt circuit the maximum shock duration is half of a second. It is extremely important to free shock victim from the contact of electric source as quickly as possible. The difference of a few seconds in starting artificial respiration may spell life or death to the victim. Don't give up unless the victim has been pronounced dead by a doctor. Women tend to be more susceptible to electric currents than men. Lower body weight increases the susceptibility to electric currents. A shock from DC is more likely to freeze or stop the victim's heart. Your feedback about this video will be highly appreciated. Our next video of this series will cover electric fire, its probable causes and safe work practices. Our contact details are Please like and subscribe our channel for more informative videos.
Thanks for watching this video.